Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the Cargo Hub in here in Transport Fever 2. Today, we're looking back here at Glendale, which we worked on last time. We were able to get all of this done in, and we got our cargo a passenger station. We got our passenger line here, and our next step was to take everything over to Victorville. Excuse me. Uh, get over here to Victorville and get that passenger station going. So I think the first thing we need to do is get a passenger station in here and i think i'm just going to go with the road that's already here this guy right here and slap it in right there so let's uh grab our buildings and i think we were going 80 meters on this no to the electric stuffs so let's get this in there i have been letting the game play because we were basically out of money so, uh, made a few changes to help with the monetary gains and kind of reconfigured some lines and deleted some lines and to help with just to make, to, I mean, finally start making money. So, um, mm -hmm. yep, 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 yep. And then we need a cargo buildings. That's what we need. We need a cargo build. Oh, we need platforms. We need platforms is what we need. Platform. Platform. Cargo building. We can slap and slap. Okay. That looks good. Now let's get our lines out of here so much tra there is so much road traffic now it's insane how much road traffic we have uh back over here tracks no to that let's get this guy laid out here and we will get our Stuff. I'm actually going to extend this out just a hair. So I extended the con mat delivery out a little bit. And what I found was is that... So this needs to come out. I'm going to actually come out to about here. That the stations weren't long enough for the, the train that I built. So... Come on, come on, give it to me. There we go. Yeah, so the stations aren't long enough for the um, train that I built. So we're eventually going to have to lengthen the stations. <laughs> so um, we want to come this direction, correct? Yeah, 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 yeah. So let's something like this. What if we do this? What if we do this? What if we do this? So our line is right here. And what if we kind of go like this? And we start a little bit like this. And what if we come over here? Before it kind of starts going up the hill. So kind of like right here. And we take this and we connect it to this road that I've lost. So it kind of, it's going to, yeah, 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 yeah. I like that. I like that. I like it a lot. There's a little bit extra monies, but I lock it. All right, we'll keep building this because I was like, it goes like it. It was going uphill, 
and then it's coming back downhill and that uphill downhill was not was not awesome it was not fantastic so kind of like kind of like this ish Keeping her going. Let's just bring this all the way in. Well, we don't want to do that because remember that last time we had that problem where I drug that too far and it made some kind of wonkiness go on. And so I don't want to do that. I want to kind of keep it next to each other here. Because it made it like one side of the track was higher than the other. And it was just ugly. So, hopefully everybody's having a wonderful morning, wonderful day. I mean, this video comes out in the morning. Most of the time when I remember to get it edited. Et, et, edited. Hey, well, that was pretty easy. All right, well, let's get our signals in. Signals, one way, yes. And one way. Right, lovely, fantastic. So let's get let's get um this guy. Manage the line. Add station. Let's get it to here. And then back to here. And then it should go to Carlsbad. Lovely. Fantastic. Amazing. We're good. Okay, we're good on that part of it. So then the next step will be to let's get a... We're going to delete... So I originally had a... Is this... Okay, one side is... One side is cargo and the other side is um, passenger. So let's go ahead and get our passenger line set up here. And I want to, let's do this. Let's extend this. Okay, then let's get our passenger lines in. Um, buildings. A boost stop. So I'm going to put that right here and right here. And I again, I always put them on both sides. It just gives the AI the opportunity to be like, oh yeah, this sounds like a fantastic place to, to stop at. We'll, we'll go this way. I'll put one like right here, and then maybe one right here. Lovely. And we'll let the AI do their business. Um, we want to do a new line, which will go from here to here to here to here and back again. So that'll be fine. And this will be, what are we in? Uh, VCVL. 
VCVL passenger passenger intra city. Okay. And then we need a couple buses. So if you didn't notice, we're into 1912 for two buses. Yeah, so we're into 1912, and it is... We actually got a few new vehicles. Uh, actually, we only got two, and they were trucks. So we got... Excuse me. Um, we'll just check it out. So we got the Benz trucks. Tarpaulin truck. And the truck with steak sides. So this whole 25 miles per hour, seven cargo. So I'm thinking actually about changing all of those out. And I don't know if there's a way to, if we look at, um, mm -hmm. vehicle manager there. How did I all, oh. ah, ha ha, but we don't want trains. We want trucks. And can we get, so if we did, well, if we went by, not that, not that, this, and we selected all of these and we chose to replace with those. So we're making the monies. So let's go ahead and start replacing these. Passenger, passenger. This is the one that I just built. So this was over here. It's a Conmat delivery. And, ooh, yeah. This was part of, I just built this in Elgin. And it just delivers construction material from here to here. And that, I, I don't know if that train's even brought anything in yet. So we were on that so food delivery let's go ahead and replace those vehicles with this guy and we've got the money right like before we start losing all of it again uh replace the selected vehicles with that fuel delivery I'm sure there's probably an easier way to do this. Oh, and this was another one. I, I had just created this one, too. So if we go over and look at this guy. There was a construction materials plant over here. And it's just taking all of this up to here. So, and it's bringing construction materials back, dropping over here at Oceanside, which will take it to Oceanside. will go to Corona or Elgin on that. And also that the line that comes in, this guy... Um, if we go and look at Toledo, the Toledo has, it, it's do, it's doing that. Okay. Anyway, it's doing its thing is what I'm saying. So that was, oh, we're on line manager. That's why intracity, intracity, delivery, delivery alpha. Let's change those out. For this guy. Fuel delivery. And I, I added some more vehicles onto some of these, but I need to go through and I... There's so many vehicles on a lot of these. Like, this has now 12 vehicles on it. And, like, how much more do I want to add on there? So, I mean, we have the money. Might as well replace these. So, so like, here's 18 vehicles. You know... 
Ah, oh, we're not going to have enough for the last three. Because that's 18 more vehicles each. So at least we'll have enough for, like, some of this stuff. So now they have... They've got... They've got enough, is what I'm saying. So... We do need to edit our... We do need to deal with these trains at some point. So you see how, like, it's got... It's carrying four of Conmat, and then it's going to be three of the stone. Eventually, what we need to do is we need to... Wow, that is very loud. Uh, eventually, what we need to do is add more of those on. So... Now that we've spent... I've spent all our money. Um... Let's check in on... Let's see how that's doing. So this has construction materials sitting there. And this is going to be wanting construction materials at some point, And it'll be taking it over to here. But that's going to take a while. Because that train is super slow, you know. So, like, our train... Um... So... Let's just do this. Like, I want to buy a vehicle. Yeah, so, I mean, we have trains. It's just, when you look at this, it's two and a half million dollars. Or, you know, two million. Or 1.41. 1. So, I think probably what we need to start doing is all these trains that are the Baldwin six-wheeler, I think we need to replace them with the at least the General and eventually get them up to the Baldwin 280. And maybe make that the default. So, like, this guy is running the general. Uh, this guy is running the general. You know, this guy probably need to switch it from that train. Like, if I edit... Can I edit this train? Edit this vehicle. And can I switch that to... The general. Can I do this and then this? Okay, so that's only four hundred and. S oh, I'm only getting two thousand for that. So what if I? I'm gonna try it. So that went from twenty five. It, it's. I think it gives us a couple miles an hour. So like, if I edit this one. This is 25, and that's 28, but it gives me a lot more horsepower and a lot more tractive effort because we're going up and down a lot of hills. So if I get rid of that and then add that, I can modify that one. I think is this the last one this one already has one so we've done all those how much oh the other ones the the trucks are like a million like 1.5 million so basically have spent all of our cash now and we're making it back pretty fast due to the just the amount of vehicles i just have on everything now which check out that like the passengers at 41 so we're doing really well and the next, the next setup we will have will be, so we, we made it over to Victorville. We're replacing some of our stuff. So the Victorville to, I think it was, we got Victorville to Huntsville to Lafayette. Cause we're Austin to Irvine to Memphis. Cause this is Hollywood to Orange, Fort Lauderdale, Fort Lauderdale, Lakewood, Memphis, so Austin, Irvine, Memphis, and then we're Victorville, Huntsville, Lafayette, Lafayette, Elk Grove, Toledo, because then this will be Memphis, Carlton, Toledo, yes.
So that's our... We, we don't have... I mean, I say that we don't have much left on this, but uh, Hollywood to Orange to Fort Lauderdale. I mean, we can continue any one of these lines for the next time. And we could try to get over these mountains or whatever for next time. But that's going to do it here for the Cargo Hub. And we are getting ever closer to being able to actually take cargo to everywhere. <laughs> Uh, one thing I did do before I go, uh, I, there was a Victorville to like Glendale passenger bus line that I did remove the last af at the end of the last episode that I didn't record. But I think our trucks are doing really well. They're finally they're making us a lot of money now after adding tons of them to each line that needed them. And hopefully that helps us out, helps us keep growing as far as money goes and helps us to keep building our line. So, hey, that's going to do it for this episode of the Cargo Hub here on the Transport Fever 2. Thanks so much for coming in and hanging out. We're over here in uh, Victorville at the station. And until next time, take care. <laughs>